Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to add custom forms to your WordPress sidebar. You see, I think a lot about flow of traffic when they get to your website. And yes, we all know to put, you know, have a contact page like we're looking at here and having form based uh, area that people can fill out and click send. But when you're in other parts of your website, let's say within my uh, mobile website optimization, which is a sub page of um, this area and it has a navigation and there's no contact. But thinking in terms of when a person comes to a, a landing page and then they want to then contact you, then they got to go up to contact and boom. I think that I'd like to put a contact form within the sidebar widget area over here. WordPress, however, does not come with any widgets internally. It's pretty surprising to me actually with a 4.0 release. There's no widget that is an automatic thing. However, WordPress does have the, the avail availability of a plugin called Contact Form 7. Let's go and look for that. Contact Forms. You just go into the back end, look it up, and you will have Contact Form 7. Let's go for it right off the top what it is and there it is contact for form 7 now you know you can just the visual editor in WordPress uh, 4 is fantastic you click it you can see what you'd see in the back end directory you can read through it see the screenshots of how it will look it doesn't read anything in here showing you how to do that but it's really simple I've already installed it and it shows up over here on the left hand side of your bar you go into contact forms and you'll see that I have a contact form set up already this was done by just simply creating a new contact form and creating this. This one here is the one that shows on my uh, back end page, which was as simple as taking this script here, copying it and pasting it into the text uh, tab area in the contact page. Now to create a widget based contact form, let's go ahead and do that. So let's create an add new set the language or add new sure they know what it is it's already set to that I didn't catch that <laughs> okay so um, all you do for this is you go into uh, this area you will want to name this let's just name it contact form widget and that's pretty easy they're gonna have you know your name they're gonna we're gonna want their email a subject a message and submit send we're gonna want it to go to our uh, there it is our email address when they do send it and uh, from this their name and then the subject and then the email and if you know if you want a message body here uh, this email was sent from a contact form on so and so my website of course uh, this is what they get um, uh, replied. So how do you get this now into it? Well, it's as simple as going here into this area beside your dash name, put a space and go 25 forward slash. That's it. Do that again, copy that and paste that just past the email put 25 dash make sure it's inside the close bracket do the same to each of these areas and that will reduce the text characters uh, that it creates so I will go save now to this and it will create this new form here is the code that you'll want to uh, highlight and then command copy or you can right click copy and then we'll go over to our widgets and we'll drag a new widget into, since it's across from the pages that I want, I'm gonna create another text widget that I'm gonna take over, put it in here. Actually, I'll put it up the top because that's the most important. And I will simply place that and I will name this form, this uh, widget, contact us uh, contact us, that's simple, not contact us with any questions, and go save. Now, I'll close it, and I will go back to the front end in pages, 
across my site, I will go into any page and let's see if things worked out. And boom, there it is. Name required subject and there's validation, I didn't send anything, but uh, you've got the gist now. You have forms that are readily easy for when people want, like what they're reading on your site, can easily email you. Okay, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in another one. Thank you very much for your time.